Hey there everyone, MonkeyDude22 here with another help tutorial video as a part of the Xbox Ambassadors program. Uh, in this video today I'm going to show you how to connect your Xbox One to Xbox Live using a wired connection and your internet modem. Now a wired connection directly to the modem is the fastest and most reliable way to connect to Xbox Live. Doing a connection in this way you'll enjoy the maximum speeds that your connection will allow and so there's many benefits to why you, this is an ideal setup. Uh, for wired connection, what we're going to need is the following items. Uh, we're going to need one Ethernet cable, an internet modem, as typically provided by your internet service provider or ISP. Sometimes you do have to purchase these separately, but you'll want to check with your ISP for more information, and an Xbox One console. So basically what we're going to do is we're going to take one end of that Ethernet cable and we're going to go ahead and plug it into the LAN Ethernet port on the back of the internet modem. Now this modem here is just for demonstration purposes. You, your modem may look a little bit different, but in the general sense they're always going to look pretty much the same. So once you go ahead and take that one end of that cable, plug it into that Ethernet port, it should snap into place, and then you're going to take the other end and you're going to connect it into the LAN Ethernet port on the back of the Xbox One console. Once you go ahead and have those both plugged securely nice and tight into the console, go ahead and turn on your internet modem and give it about a minute for it to power up. And you'll know when it's powered up because you'll see a couple of different lights on and it's generally when you see a, a solid internet light uh, that you know you're good to go. Once you're done with that though, go ahead and turn on the Xbox One console because we're going to go ahead and run some tests here to make sure that you have a strong, reliable connection to Xbox Live. So once we have the console booted up, uh, we're going to go ahead and run over to the settings section here. And we're going to go ahead and hit A on settings, all settings, and then we're going to go ahead and open up network. And once you open up network, go ahead and hit A on network settings. And then you're going to see it says we have a wired connection here, but let's go ahead and test the network connection. Looks like we're good connected to the internet, so let's go ahead and double check by testing the multiplayer connection. Usually goes pretty quickly. But once we have a good connection here on the multiplayer section, we're going to go ahead and check the detailed network stats. Looks like we're good there for multiplayer, so there's no issues with NAT settings or with Xbox Live. Uh, we'll go into detailed network status just to take a look at what our download upload speeds are. Uh, this is where you want to check if you maybe you're seeing slow speeds because you might have something like a packet loss or a high latency. Uh, there's a bunch of different uh, tutorial guides for that, which I'll post in the description. Uh, looks like we've got a good speeds here, good download speed, good upload, no packet loss, fairly low latency. I would be satisfied with this connection. I shouldn't have any issues playing on Xbox Live, so we should be good to go. You can go ahead and back out to the dashboard, and you can go ahead and sign in by hitting left on the thumbstick to pull open the guide, and go ahead and sign into your profile, and you'll be good to go. Thanks very much for watching this video. If you do run into any errors while using this guide, please take a look at the video description as I'll be putting some helpful links for more steps, including the same guide in a step-by-step -step format. I'll also place a link to a guide with more information about various errors you may encounter while running those connection tests and how to resolve them. I'm MonkeyDo22 with the Xbox Ambassadors program. You can learn more about the Xbox Ambassadors by going to community.xbox.com ambassadors. Thanks again for watching, and I'll see you on Xbox Live.